Great touch though by Nishan Balukale into the box. Cadete, surely! Well, that is some clearance from Jack Clisby. Under enormous pressure, he could so easily have diverted that into his own net. He launched over the top and Glory a little bit betwixt and between. And Romero is so, so unfortunate to see that come back off the uprights. Almost an hour played on a tense afternoon in Melbourne. Three points at a premium for both. Here goes Trent Osler down the left. And the cross was deflected. Here's a chance. Dows couldn't steer it over the line. The silver is hurt. Victory survive. The first real cause for alarm in their own penalty box. Chris Economides to run after, but Ford's got there initially ahead of him, but Economides too strong. Ford Aroli around the goalkeeper, surely. No. It's Clisby again to save the day for Perth. Victory thought the moment had arrived. And corner kick duty. Ford to near post, and a brilliant stop by Paul Izzo to deny Luke Bodnar, who flew in to meet that corner. Perth have come away with the ball, it's Ryan Williams, Taggart lurking in the box, here he is! Oh, that was the moment, that was the moment for glory. A long way from being confirmed, it's a lovely turn by Ford Rolly, the ricochet will favour Brooks. Is there late drama here, Leighton Brooks? We'll see again, oh, is there a foul there? Daniel Alder has a look at it, and says, corner. VAR will be looking at that, no doubt. And then there's a flare-up involving Cadete and Beavers, who go head-to-head. -head. Involving Mark Beavers. Well, Mark Beavers has already been booked, so he's off. If he's got a second yellow, yep, yeah, that's confirmed. Daryl Latchman got a yellow as well as Roderick Miranda, so Perth will end with 10 men.